the Rail Academy has been set up to um, provide railway, professional railway training um, and academic railway training for, for our students. The rail industry is very, very buoyant um, and these guys represent exactly um, what the industry needs. I've been in the industry, I've also been in the world of academia and I've never seen both combined like, like we do here. So I think the product that we're producing um, is a more complete, more rounded person who can go into the industry and be job ready, become an asset to a company on day one rather than going into a company and having to be developed. The college have, have consistently engaged with industry partners so through the design that we were looking at um, or taking advice from Network Rail, people like the National Skills Academy for Railway Engineering, NSAR as they're known, um, and they helped guide what should be done in this building. The agreement that we've got with ISS Labour um, consists of um, they're going to give 10 students workplace trials and of the 10 students a minimum of five will be full-time employed. I was introduced to the Rail Academy by the National Skills Academy for Railway about 18 months ago and they said can you have a look at the new facility that's been developed in, up in Gateshead. I felt that what Mark and his team were trying to achieve here was something with which I want to do as well which is introduce new engineers into the railway and do things a bit differently. Do things for the greater good as opposed for the, for the, for the, the individual businesses good. Uh, it will pay uh, uh, long term dividends and it's just, it's, it's just the, the character, the feeling and the atmosphere about how Mark's delivering that here in the Rail Academy. We are leading the way in railway training in terms of we're bringing in people who at this point in time at 16 years old um, are not necessarily employable. Um, for a number of reasons, they have to be 18 to gain full-time employment in the railway. So what we are doing is we're buying two years up front, giving them that railway education and then saying to the employer, right, this guy's he's now of age, but he's also got two years of railway experience in, he, in his pocket, so to speak, because we've got a facility that allows us to do that. We will then continue with their training and education and hopefully in close concert with the Rail Academy and NCG. We'll develop them uh, throughout their careers so that it will go perhaps to level 4, level 5, level 6 training so that come 30 years time they're senior engineers working on the overhead line electrification business. So that's the partnership that uh, ourselves and the Rail Academy have uh, uh, agreed. It's long term um, and it means that there's a career progression for them as well in the industry. The most thing I particularly like about the Academy is the fact that the staff are really good. Um, in terms of the, the facilities and stuff, they're fantastic, they're really good. All the tools are spot on and you get a chance to work with some really good, like, good bits of kit. I'm hoping to work for ISS for, well, for the rest of my <laughs> life. Yeah. I've heard all of his good things about it. I mean, it's, well, obviously good pay and stuff. And the fact that like, I, really, I really enjoy working over the overheads, um, a brilliant opportunity. It really is a really good opportunity. The railway is entirely training hungry right now, uh, at all levels. So, uh, as as these projects come into you know fruition, such as HS2, for example, it's a huge um, construction project essentially at the start, um, which is going to involve 50,000 um, employees. You now, these people don't exist in the industry right now. There's a there's a huge demand for all sorts of different training at the moment. So, what we're doing is very very timely. So it's important that there's training, it's important that their career in the railways is seen as being something attractive and something through life, and that's something which Mark and myself, ISS Label, want to do. It's an exciting industry to be in. Uh, the railway is, is developing, it's fast, it it's, it's involves all the engineering skills that are required, so it will just confirm and it will excite them, but it will primarily it will embed the lessons they've learned here in the, in the Rail Academy. I've been lucky enough to get sponsored by ISS Labour. A um, lot of opportunities there, you know, you're going to have a good career if you follow your heart and stick to it. It's the feel of the place, it's how, it's how the students engage with each other, it's how the students engage with visitors, it's how you're welcome to the building. It has a different feel to most um, training or educational establishments I've been to. People want to learn, people like coming here and you've seen that in the numbers of new students who've come in 2015. It has a good feel to the place. I like it and I like the people here. <laughs>